The new measures do take effect today and will continue through at least the holiday weekend with the nine o'clock curfew just one of several steps that the city is taking to try and reduce after hours violent crime at 31st Street Beach. Not even the gray skies and somewhat drizzly weather was going to keep celebrants away from 31st Street Beach today, where large family gatherings and elaborate barbecues were the name of the game. We're doing some fruit, some lamb, some chicken, you know, just enjoy it. What is different this year is the amount of security, with additional police patrols checking bags and monitoring the parking lots. That, along with new fencing and significantly a 9 o'clock curfew imposed by the Chicago Police Department, a move that 4th Ward Alderman Lamont Robinson has been calling for a couple of weeks now. 9 p.m. is put in place because it takes an hour, if not almost two hours, depending on how many people are at the beach, to be able to clear the beach. And so what's happening is at 11 p.m., uh, the previous closure, uh, the beach is not cleared until 12.30 a.m. or 1 a.m. And that's where we're seeing most incidents happen. At least five people were shot and one stabbed at or near 31st Street Beach during the month of June, with most incidents taking place after 10 p.m. And because many of these happen in the parking lots, the Chicago Park District says no vehicles will be allowed in after 8 p.m. and all cars must exit the lot by 11 p.m. Signage has been set up at different points along the beach to inform beachgoers of the policy. I want people to enjoy our beautiful beach. Unfortunately, we've had nine incidents of shootings uh, with young people and enough is enough. And so we have to prioritize public safety. Longtime friends and 31st Street Beach patrons Ruthie Redmond and James Powell have differing views on the new measures. Typically when a lot of that happens, the beach is typically closed, so it's unfortunate that we, the people who are uh, law-abiding citizens, have to suffer from that. It's a shame that it gets to, that has gotten to that point, but if, if that's what we have to do to, 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 to put an edge on it, uh, I'm all for that. While the 9 o'clock curfew is slated for now to expire on Monday, the Alderman's office tells us that it could be extended if deemed necessary. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.